Hey gamers, ESC Season 2 has been announced and we wanted to go through the changes, but first, what hasn't changed since Season 1? Firstly, ESC's overall vision and goals to promote and grow esports in Australia and New Zealand through high stakes, fast paced and entertaining content has not changed. Neither have our tournament start times or dedication to live streaming every single match. We are also sticking with the same games from Season 1, Street Fighter 6 and Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 cross-play on PC, Xbox and PlayStation. 1v1s, cash prizes, championship rings and the low $10 entry fee are also here to stay in Season 2. So what has changed? The first change is a longer season. Season 1 was 8 weeks with 3 qualifiers and a season final per game. Season 2 will be 10 weeks, 4 qualifiers and a season final for each game. These will continue to alternate weeks throughout the season. Qualifying for the Season Finals in Season 2 has also changed. Only the winner from each qualifier will automatically advance to the Season Final. But don't stress, players will still earn ranking points throughout the season and we will take the top players from the rankings to fill out the 8 player double elimination Season Final draw. This means consistency is key to grabbing that final spot. We have taken onboard feedback from the community and have changed our tournament formats for the qualifiers. For Street Fighter 6, the qualifiers will still be best of 3 battles with three rounds per battle. But instead of a 32 player single elimination format, it will be a 16 player double elimination format. Even if you stumble, you've got a second shot at glory. For Modern Warfare 3, things have shaken up quite a bit. It is still 1v1 on small maps, but instead of a single five minute round, we're now doing best of three rounds. A map change and a chance at a new random loadout will happen between rounds. Each round will be three minutes long, but the first player to get 10 kills can win the round early. If no one reaches 10 kills before the timer expires, the most kills will win. Of course, we still have our 60 second tiebreaker if needed. We have also changed the Modern Warfare 3 format from single elimination to a 16 player double elimination tournament. By changing to these new formats, players will have more chances to show their skills, earn more ranking points and get more value for their entry fee. We have also tweaked the prize money slightly to suit these new format changes. Full details can be found on the tournament pages on our website. Lastly, instead of two week windows to enter the next qualifier, you can enter the qualifiers for the entire season in advance, starting right now. Do not wait and make sure you enter quickly to not miss out. Season two starts Saturday, May the 4th, 2024. Can you master the game to claim the fame?